I should have gone through the tall grass. Maybe I would have ran into a metapod. Maybe. When do I get a new... When do I get a new war... <laughs> Mild nature. Met in Route 1 at level 2. Dude, it'd be awesome if we got really far with this guy. He needs 13 experience to level up. I don't know about Olmar. Olmar can, like, hang out there. We need him to become a Butterfree, though. Butterfrees are good. Butterfrees are, like, really good to have. Fucking Caterpie. Get out of here. If I had Wing Gust, then it'd be all over. I think I would actually do that. I'd be like, aha. You trying to use String Shot on me? It don't do shit. It reminds me of a, actually, I don't, I don't remember watching Pokemon as a kid, but I do remember when I got in trouble at, uh, at, like, an after school program I was in. I, I, like, got grounded, and then I had to, like, and then, like, the Pokemon Marathon was on, so it was, it was pretty much, I watched TV for, like, the whole week I was grounded. Which, I mean, I guess isn't, this isn't a good punishment, but I lost all my video games and shit, because I got in trouble for some just, like, random bullshit that I, that, that, you know, it's just like, it's just like, why would you do that to a kid? Listen, I accidentally, like, it, I was, like, little, I was, like, still in, like, elementary school. So I think this is a fair thing. I got mad because I got out in dodgeball. <laughs> no, wait, it wasn't dodgeball. It was kickball. So I got out in kickball, and I got really upset about it. And I walked over to the teacher who was, like, on the other team because, you know, like, sometimes the teachers like to play, like, to play with the kids. And, you know, it's fun sometimes when you're on the teacher's team. But I got out. So I got really upset, and I walked over to him, and I punched him in the leg. Like, I, like, I don't even think I, like, hit him, hit him. I, like... I like desperate. I like walked over, like booped him in the leg, and then he was like, and then and then it was like, <gasps> I, I swear to God, I did not hit him as hard as I thought I as as hard as they thought I did. But apparently, they they came they came to me and they're like, all right, you're in trouble. And it's like I understand, like you shouldn't hit people. That's like wrong on so many. You shouldn't like go you, if, even when you're angry, you shouldn't go up to people and punch them. I understand that. But I walk up to him, I punch him in the leg, and then, like, after that, that I, I, go, I get in trouble. Okay, that's fine. I got in trouble for doing something stupid. It's perfectly fine. I understand my, my problem I had there, and it was completely my fault. But then, the lady, the other, like, the other person who ran the, ran the like, uh, program or whatever, she threatened to call the cops on me as a kid. I was, like, I was, like, what, 10 years old? And she threatened, she was, like, what you did there... What you did there was an awful thing you should have done, and I understood that. And she's like, well, you know, what happens to people like that? We call the cops. And I'm like, oh my gosh. Oh my gosh, why would you... Why would you say that? And I got, like, really, like, upset, and I started crying. Because I'm like, I'm like, no, I don't want to... I don't want the cops to get called. And I was, like, crying profusely. And then they called my parents, and they told them what happened. And I was, like, still... I was still, like... I was crying, I'm like, I don't want to go, I don't want to get called by the cops and everything like that, and all this bullshit, and I was, like, so upset, and, you know, as a kid, you know, when some, when an adult tells you something like that, you're, you're genuinely, like, you're genuinely, like, upset and angry about it, because you're like, this isn't, this isn't, that's not what I, like, you know, you're just kind of mad and shit, and then uh, the other punishment, not only did I have to, like, sit out, I couldn't watch the movie that Friday day, on that Friday night, because, you know, every Friday, you guys would watch, like, a movie, it was a cute little movie. It was probably like something stupid, like uh, all all uh, Muppets Take Manhattan or something like that. But you all would watch a movie. And you sit there, you all watch your dumb movie. I couldn't watch the movie. Oh, Kakune, we can switch to what's his face. We can switch to Wings a lot, baby. But yeah, I couldn't watch the movie that week. I couldn't watch the movie that Friday, and I had to be in the I had to be in the stupid room where all the babies were, and I had to take care of the babies, like as a ten year old. I got in trouble and it was like, uh, here's your, here's one of your punishments. You have to take care of the, the babies in the children room. It's like, what the fuck? What the fuck? And then I found out later on that that place has like a really bad, uh, really bad, like, uh, like employee problem. Like they have like, like genuinely never have anybody on staff. So that punishment was probably like to save them a couple bucks. And it was like bullshit. I couldn't do anything for a week. It was the worst thing in my entire life. <laughs> and then after that, I've never, I try if I, I just bottle everything up. I just, I just, I'm like, I'm like, I don't want to get in trouble ever again. This is bullshit. I don't ever want to, I don't want, I don't want it to go through that experience ever again. I don't know. I don't know if, it, I don't know if someone, someone will be like, uh, what, what happened to you is bad, is, is an awful thing to happen to someone like that. But I guess it got the message across that it's like, it's like, oh, you shouldn't have done that. We're going to call, I don't, I don't, I don't know if. I don't know if that's the right method to go go away from it. It's like, ah, you were gonna 
call the cops and then call your parents. It's like, wait a minute. And I swear there was one point where she like, she's like, all right, the cops are out here waiting for you. And I was like crying. I was just like miserable. I hated it. I hated that place. There was one summer when I was like going into middle school and like the last week before, before, uh, before middle school start, I'm like, mom, grandma, I want to just like stay home. Like, I don't want to go back there. Like I, I never want to go back there ever again. I genuinely don't. And they're like, okay, you can stay home this week. And I'm like, yes. And then after that, I could, I got to stay home all the time. I got to stay home all the time. I just was by myself. And guess what? The week after that, I rented Simpsons Hope and Hit and Run from Blockbuster. Hell yeah, baby. Oh, uh, that was another life story with the Electrified Gamer. Thank you for listening. Thank you for listening to one of my many childhood experiences. What happened in middle school? I got, I got, I got bullied. <laughs> I got bullied relentlessly. That's what happened in middle school. Middle school was shit. Middle school was worse. Elementary school wasn't that bad. Element wait. It was kind of bad sometimes. Listen, I don't remember too much about elementary school. I remember I got in trouble one time because I accidentally, I was I was playing with my friends and I had like a I had like a spitball like you know you like like put the put the thing in the put the thing in the straw and you spit it out and I was trying to shoot it at my friend and he dodged it and it like landed on the back of a girl's head and <laughs> and you know this is like a son of a bitch it's like gosh dang it. And she literally got up and told the teacher, and then I got and then I got detention. Then I got in trouble, and I got and I got school detention, not school detention. I got stupid lunch detention, where it's like you sit down here, you're gonna sit down here for the day, and you can't move. You can't move from this one. Sp you can't do anything really, and it's just like this isn't fun. This isn't fun in the slightest. I was just just like when you have like so many experiences as a kid, where it's like. Or it's like you get in trouble for stuff. You just you just don't want to do anything. You just kind of like shut down. I think that's what happened. I don't want to like talk. I don't want to like talk to anybody in school, or I don't want to talk to anybody because I'm afraid like I'll say the wrong thing and they'll be mad at me. I don't want to get in trouble and say the wrong. Like I think that's always been like a problem that I've had like in school and in life in general. That it's like oh as a kid in elementary school I was like goofy and stupid and would say just random shit that came to my top of my head. And then, like, you know, you get into middle school and people are like, what the fuck this kid just say? He's, like, so cringe. He's, like, a piece of shit and we hate him. We should bully this kid. And then you get bullied relentlessly. And then you're just like, oh, I'm never going to talk again. I don't want to talk anymore. Like, what's the point in talking? Like, there's no there's no point in talking anymore. Like, in, in general, like, I'm just going to get sit here and get made fun of. So I'm just going to shut up and just, like, like, put my hand in my hand. Just, like kind of like do the thing where you like kind of like lay down in class and you just don't pay attention and I wasn't even that smart in school I wasn't even like a genius in school I was like average I was like a C student baby I was a C boy I was a good old C boy completely average I didn't even know wings a lot had all this had all this momentum going for her now look at her she's grown so much in the past 10 seconds in the past 10 minutes we've been uh talking about our like life life expectancy and all that shit whatever we're talking about I really wish a good poke. I really wish a Weedle would have spawned here, so I could have gotten the, so I could have gotten like another bug Pokemon. Son of a bitch! A critical hit. I like that later on in the game, like you do like these like insane like super attacks to everybody, and and they like and then it's like half their health bars dead, and it's just like that's all Pokemon is at the end towards the end of the game. It's just you doing like old mega attacks, Caterpie. No, don't change. Sir Wingslot needs to get to level nine. Sir Wingslot, you got this? Who catches two Caterpies? Who's like, ah, yes, two Caterpies, please? Sir Wingslot, use Tackle. Yeah, baby. Go again. Your string shot can do shit to me. It's like, ah, no, my wings, they're all gunky now. Yeah, I can go I can go from talking about some random bullshit that happened to, my, to, happen to me as a kid to going back to talking about how the Caterpie uh, smacked me in the face with its big eyebrow. Yeah, you know, I can... I can I can flip on a dime like that. I can flip like a dime. I can shoot with the rest of them. I can shoot with the rest of them. Hit with the best of them. Get out of here, you Caterpie! You don't even got our name. None of these other trainers. I really wish there was like a there was like a thing that like I don't know what you would call it. It would like it would like give. Ooh, Gus, that's good. That's real. I don't know what I need a for maybe like the bug type gym. I think there's a bug type gym. I was like, why do I need a a Pidgey? I was about to say, if he evolves, that'd be great. Uh, bag. 
I haven't, um, I haven't, I haven't touched Omar once. Don, you're in the background now. It's all about Sir Wings a lot. Sir, Madam Wings a lot in her beautiful ghostly in a beautiful mane as she flows it through the wind, baby. I don't even know where to go for Caterpie. I don't know what to. Should I just go into Tackle Overdrive? What does he have? He's got he's got shield dust prevents added effect. Oh, that's a good. Oh, wow, that's that's his a thing of magic. Those are his like backup attacks or whatever you call them. His backup attacks. Those are like his uh his special his passive ability whatever you call it. Wait, what is Squirt what is Squirtle's passive ability? Does he have one? Squirtle? I've never read these. Uh, torrent ups water moves in a pinch. Oh, okay. Torrent. Like we torrent movies live on the internet. Oh shit! I shouldn't have I shouldn't have mentioned that. You know what? Screw it! Screw it! There's a Metapod! Get him! Get him! <laughs> Get him, Omar! Butt him with your head! Attack! Get him! Wild Metapod! Use his Harden! You think you stand a chance against me? You think you stand a chance against me, baby? Omar, use Tackle! Yeah, baby! We're gonna be here for a while. We're gonna- we're, Oh, just screw it. We'll switch to- we'll switch to the boy. Sir Wingslot, get on out here! Sir Wingslot! Woo! Metapod, use Harden! You won't stand a chance against this Gus, baby! This Gus is gonna take you down to Chinatown, baby. Flying, yes. Oh, I like the I like the animation where like he like moves forward and like a tornado spawns out of his beak, and it's like, what the fuck was that? I think that's Wing Attack, actually. That's the that's the animation. It's like, hiya! I remember giving a kid my cartridge for the uh, in middle school for uh, what do you call it? Not Sword and Shield, freaking. I don't know what the name of the game is now. Freaking Mario 64 DS. So he could unlock all the shit for me because I didn't know how to unlock anything in that game. I was like, I don't know how to play this game. I'm scared of the Boo House. Remember, I mentioned that in Mario 64. I, I was scared of that Boo House. I wasn't going anywhere near that. Luigi was going to get stuck there and I could never play as him. Metapod. Metapod's level 7. Omar, go. Go, you beautiful thing. Now switch. Switch out. We should level up Don to level 10, but hey. Sir Wingslot's getting some use, baby. Sir Wingslot's like, I've become stronger than anyone can ever imagine, and now I'm the God Slayer. It's like, okay, Sir Wingslot, calm down there. Calm down there, Sir Wingslot. Calm down. <laughs> Sir Wingslot, you know, she, he, she's a little high and mighty on herself, but you know, hey. Hey, on the bright side, at least she has a positive outlook on her life. At least she genuinely thinks highly of herself. You know, you'd rather have, you'd rather be hanging out with someone who has a positive outlook on their life than someone who's down in the dumps. Like, like Omar. Omar's a freaking asshole. That guy, that guy is always talking about how sad he is all the damn time. Wings a lot, game 54 experience, you damn right. Expect to send out a Caterpie. Yes, I'll switch to my Caterpie. Go, Omar. The Don and his girls, you see the Don standing back. The Don's like, I'm holding back because, you know, I want to see how my girls are doing. I want to see my girls do the thing. I want to see my girls, they're doing the thing out there, and I know they can do it. I know that they are capable of doing things that I am incapable of doing. Go, Wings a lot. Gotta be used tackle. Sir Wings a lot's like, Ugh, you dumb bitch. <laughs> you dumb bitch. You done fucked up now, asshole. Woo, baby. That's a Pokemon battle, if you ask me. That's a good old fashioned Pokemon battle. Wings a lot. Yes. About to send out Metapod. Not Metapod. Switch. We're gonna keep doing this until one of us levels up. We gotta level up our girls. Metapod's not that strong. I don't know what bug type is a uh, is effective against. It's effective against this tackle him. Get him. Watch ya. Uh you're you're almost there. You're almost there. You're almost there. 20 experience. What if you catch a Pokemon at level 1? What is it like 20 HP or some bullshit like that? Someone's going to get real mad. They're going to be like you're not supposed to switch out in Darina. I think that's one of like the the added rules you can't do. Like, people add a bunch of rules to Nuzlocke. I'm just doing the basic one, where it's just like, Ah, if your Pokemon dies, it's over. And you can only catch one Pokemon per area. You only catch one Pokemon, the first one you encounter, per area. That's it. That's all I only want to do. And I'm not doing, like, the, the like, Oh, you can't switch out your Pokemon during battle, because that'd be boring. That'd be a hell of a fun time. I gotta level up my Caterpie. I better hope to God that I don't get decimated by Metapod and his Leaf Shield. Wait, he don't have Leaf Shield. Wait a minute. Take this. <laughs> this guy's like probably pissed off at me. He's like, this asshole keeps switching. He's like, aha. It's like, go Caterpie. Come back, Caterpie. Go. Sir Wings a lot. Who the hell is Sir Wings a lot? Oh my gosh, a Pidgey. Yeah, Omar's level six, baby. Wings a lot gained 54. Sir Wings a lot is the first level 10. Now the Don's like, I'm proud of her. I'm proud of her. She's a good girl. She's a good girl. 
I'm afraid every time I say that, my dog's gonna like walk in and be like, I'm a good girl. Who's a girl? Me? Me? I'm a good girl. I am a good girl. You damn right I'm a good girl. It's like, yes, you are. Yes, you are, dog. I want to find that Pikachu. I remember I would sit here for hours looking for a stupid Pikachu because I'm like, I want a Pikachu. And I could never find one. I remember once I just wanted one so it'd be like easier to run through Misty's gym because you just like electrocute everybody and you win. Oh shit. This is a Pikachu. I'm going to get pissed. It's a Caterpie again. Another Caterpie. Not another one. Omar, go. Omar, you beautiful thing. You got this, Omar. Yeah, Omar. It's the battle of the tackles. Who's gonna win first? Captain Eyebrows or Olmar? I shouldn't name him Captain Eyebrows. It just looks like an eyebrow. It's Captain Eyebrows. Captain Eyebrows in his magnificent comb of hair. Omar's speed fell, but that doesn't matter because Omar used tackle. Omar miss. Fuck. Omar, you dickhead. Omar used tackle. Ow. You don't stand a chance against me. Mine is mine's is stronger than you could possibly ever imagine. You keep using string shot. I'm gonna smack that string shot out of your face, you dumbass piece of sh Oh, I'm just getting mean. I'm trying not to cuss. I'm trying not to cuss. This is a this is a PG level. This is a PG level uh uh Pokemon playthrough. We gotta get them kids in here. We gotta I gotta get them kids. That doesn't sound right. We gotta get them kids in here. I gotta be like, welcome guys to another episode of Pokemon on the Nintendo Switch. Wow. Welcome back. <laughs> Hey, you remember that last time when I talked about how I got in trouble for punching my teacher? That was a pretty cool a segment, am I right, gamers? Am I right, my fellow gamers? I don't remember, there was another time I got, like, actual, like, after-school detention, but I don't remember why I got it. I remember I got, I got upset or angry about something. I have, I think I have rage problems, to be honest with you. I don't know where this comes from, but... I've, I've de like, as you grow older, like, you realize that it's like, wow, I was, like, a real asshole as a kid, and you, you grow up, you don't just, you don't go, like, I was an asshole as a kid, but you know what, I'm still an asshole, <laughs> you know, you're like, damn, I was an asshole, I was, like, a dickhead, I don't know what happened in school, I remember I got really angry at some, I don't remember what I got angry about, like, it genuinely escapes my memory, but I remember I got really mad, and I, like, pushed a desk, I, like, I like flipped over a desk because I was so angry at the teacher for some reason or whatever. And then afterwards, like after I flipped it, I was like, oh my gosh, I'm so sorry. Like I like immediately started apologizing and getting like really sad. And I was like, I didn't mean to do that. I was like, it was just a moment. She's like, yep, after school detention now. I'm like, oh my gosh. Then I got in trouble again. And then that was another one of those things where, you know, I was just like, ah, whatever. I was just like, oh, I got in trouble again in school. But, you know, I explained it to my parents. I was like, I got mad. I don't know. I still am trying to figure out why I got mad. I don't remember. Olmar, go! I, I don't think it will I don't think it will ever come to me why I got mad. It's just going to be one of those things where I'm like, I got mad. That's it. That's how, that's the whole story. Freaking poison sting. Get the fuck out of here with the poison sting shit. Tackle him. Yeah, baby. Ooh, critical hit, baby. Critical hit. That's all you got is poison sting? Isn't that like a grass type move? Isn't that, isn't that good for Brock's gym? Shit, I'm going to have to switch. I'm gonna have to switch. Don, go! Knock him dead, Don! Come back! Go, the Don! The Don's back, baby! The Don's back, baby! The Don's like, I've been in a hibernation, waiting. Waiting for the right moment. I've been telling my girls out there they, they need to go out there and prove to themselves why they are the queens. And now that they have proved to themselves that they are the queens, I can now come back thoroughly and come back at you at full speed. There you go, baby. Whee! The Don's back, baby. The Don's back. Omar gained 18 experience. Don gained 18. Yeah, Don. You level 10? Almost a war turtle? He learned withdrawal. I don't know what that does. It sounds cool, though. It sounds awesome. Sounds like a fun thing to have. What you got, old man? Have you noticed skinny trees on the roadside? Yeah, you need cut. I know that. Stupid cut. Many Pokemon live only in the forests and caves. You need to, you need to be persistent and look everywhere to the, the, the different kinds. Cool, whatever. Do you know the evolution cancel technique? When a Pokemon is evolving, you can stop the process. It's a technique for raising Pokemon the way they are. That's cool. You just hit B. You're just like, no, you are not evolving on my. I've gotten a. I've gotten someone on Route Two, right? Yeah. I can't believe this is still Route Two. It's like pewter, pewter city. Pew Brock, you're gonna get decimated, bitch. Brock's gonna get absolutely destroyed by my godlike skills, baby. I ain't losing to this Pokemon I ain't losing to no Pokemon gyms, gosh dang it. They're gonna have to fight me in the street if they want a piece of me. Thanks, buddy. I hope we see you again. I hope I see you again too, Nurse Joy. You're such a such a nice lady. Alright, Don, it's up to you now. It's up to you, my boy. 
It's up to my boy, the Don. Yawn. Your Strigglepuff sings. Pokemon, get drowsy. Me too. Oh no, be careful. That, that motherfucker's gonna try to write on your face. Jigglypuff! Oh, it plays the... It actually plays the... Actually plays the Jigglypuff thing. Hey, you fall asleep. Jigglypuff steals your Pokemon. Wait, what? Hold on a second. You can't steal my Pokemon. What? Team Rocket is at Mount Moon Hook. Huh. I'm on the phone. Scram. Oh, well, you didn't look like you were on the phone. I'm just saying. I really want a Pikachu, so I'm trading my Clefairy for one. Okay. I really want a Pi- I'll trade you, you- I'm trading Pokemon with that kid there. I had two Pikachus, so I figured I might as well trade one. We'll go over there and trade, gosh dang it. You're just gonna have a staring contest at each other for like 10 hours. Be like, I'm gonna- Who's gonna make the first move? Who's gonna make the first move? Me or that guy? Brock ain't gonna see it coming. When I throw down my- Throw down my Squirtle, he's gonna be like, Shit, I hope that one doesn't know Bubble. Bubble, baby! Psst, do you know what I'm doing? No. That's right, it's a hard- It's hard work. Okay, see ya. <laughs> Alright, bye. Weirdo. Weird kid. Just- Just hang- What the fuck is he doing? Who are you, shop owner? Did you know- Did you check out the museum? Hell yeah, I did. Weren't those fossils from Mount Moon amazing? Yeah, they were. Whoa, they were so cool. Like, like I say, yeah, I was there. Who goes to the museum? The museum's boring. Museums for little babies. Yes, it's fifty dollars for a child. I'm not a child. I'm a grown ass girl. Gosh dang it! Right, fifty dollars. Thank you. I don't even know why you come in here to see all the shitty fossils. Maybe someone gives you something in here. I should be grateful for my long life. Never did I think I would get to see the bones of a dragon. Uh, there's like seven hundred dragon Pokemon that live here. Your your life's pretty sad. I'm just saying. I want a Pikachu. It's so cute. I asked my daddy to catch me one. He's like, I don't have enough money to catch a freaking Pokeball. Hey, a Pikachu. Hey, a Pikachu soon, I promise. If I come here with a Pikachu, does he give- do I, Is he like, ah, oh, Pikachu! This month we're running a space exhibit. Oh, great, fantastic. Oh, I love going to the Pokemon Museum to see space moonstones, huh? What's so special about it? it looks like an ordinary rock to me. Oh, this teaches you about evolution things right. July 20th, 1969. Humans kind set foot on the moon that day. I bought a color TV just so I could watch the news. Are you telling me that they- th this- this world- Exists within the world that we live in currently right now. He's like, ah, yes, I remember when we first walked on the moon. Remember, it's like the old days. It's like the good old days. Gosh, dang it! It's like it is like the good old days, old man. Good on you. Good on you, man. Let's go to this gym. Let's let's destroy Brock. Get my Boulder Badge, baby. Woo! Here we go. He ain't gonna stand a chance, is he? Hiya. Do you wanna do you wanna dream big? Do you dare to dream of becoming the Pokemon champ? I'm no trainer, but I can advise you how to win. Let me take you to the top, sure. All right, let's get happening. The first Pokemon out in the matches at the left of the Pokemon list. By cha oh, gosh dang it, I don't need these tips. Hiya, do you want to dream big? No, fuck off. I hate my dreams. My dreams are shit. They're not even my dreams. They're Professor Oak's dreams. I was forced into this situation. Gosh dang it, I got another hint. This is like the stupid owl from, um, it's like the stupid owl from whatever you call it, from Zelda, where you're like, where you like rush through his text and you hit yes again, you're like, no, no, why did I mean to hit yes again? What do you got, a Geo dude? Bring it. Oh shit, Geo dude, Geo dude. Oh shit, Geo dude, it's a da Don. Here he comes. He's like, shit. Get those bubbles. Woo! You get bubbled, bitch. You just got bubbled. Woo! You're dead. Easy. What? What? Wait a minute. No, my ultimate plan. Defense curl. You idiot. He used the Sonic defense curl. I remember back in the day, if you like recorded certain uh, certain video games on YouTube, like Sega Genesis games or whatever, they wouldn't record correctly. So like it, like sometimes the recording would get messed up. So like if you see Sonic Shield, it would like flicker in a weird way. I know that probably doesn't make any sense unless you've like actually watched like a bunch of YouTube videos, like I have. Like I remember people bringing mention to it all the time. Champ's about to send out Sandshrew. Sandshrew. No, I don't want to switch out. Go Sandshrew. Show him what you got. Shanshrew's like, Shanshrew? 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 I should have had a bloody Shanshrew right there. I said, if we run out of things to commentate about, we'll talk We'll talk in Australia. We'll talk in Australia, we will. It was super effective. Get defected, you yeah, punk. Shanshrew speeds down, because he's a wimp. You think I'm scared of you, Shanshrew? You think I fear such a pitiful monster like you? Get these bubbles. Take them bubbles, baby. Take them gosh dang bubbles. You're out of here. You're out of here. If I, if I make it to the Elite Four and I like die, I'll just beat the game. I'll just beat the game normally. Be like, ah, yes, uh, Nuzlocke over. <laughs> Nuzlocke's done. Thanks for watching. Now we'll just play the game normally. No, I'll play it legit. I'll play it legit. See how far I get. So, 
So you're here, I'm Brock, Computer City's gym leader. My rock hard willpower is evident even in my Pokemon. My Pokemon are all rock hard and have true grit determination. That's right, my Pokemon are all rock type. <laughs> you're going to challenge me knowing that you'll lose? That's the trainer's honor that compels you to challenge me. Fine then, show me your best. All right, bring a bitch. He's like, I hope you don't have a water type. Go, Squirtle. Go, the Don. Geo, dude. No, Geo, dude, again. Go, Don. Yo, it's me, the Don. Who the fuck's this guy? Who the fuck's this rock son of a bitch? Who the hell does he think he is? Get him out of here. Get him out of the Don gimmick. Will it run? To oh, shit, you got crit, baby. You just got critted. My boy, my boy Don just destroyed your ass. Yeah, baby. Woo, level 12. My boys are growing up. My, my, my boys are growing up really fat. Oh, shit. He's going to level up. Onyx, bring it. Bring it. Squirtle's going to destroy your face. Level 14, Onyx. I ain't scared of you. Take this. No, use bind. It missed, you fucker. Aha. Aha, you missed, you dumbass. How's it feel to miss? Don't feel too good. Do it. Woo. Super effective, baby. Get ready for more bubbles. Ow. Please. I have a hard, I have my hard, rock hard Squirtle shield on, baby. Ain't no way you're penetrating my defenses. You're dead. You, you don't even, I don't know why you even tried. I don't even know why you tried. I, I came here and destroyed your Pokemon instantaneously. 324 experience. Holy shit. If I had the Pokemon share on, wants to learn, hell yeah, he does. Yeah, he wants to learn water gun. <laughs> Screw bubbles. We got the water. It only has a, uh, it has 20 power. What is water gun? 25 uses. Bubble has... Screw Tail Whip. We got Water Gun, baby. One, two, and poof. Forgot Tail Whip. And he learned Water Gun. And my boy, the Don's like, I've become stronger. I have the ability to shoot water from a gun. He just pulls out a gun. It's like, it's like, ah, no, it hurts. <laughs> you received the, you received the Boulder Badge, baby. Easy. Easy. First milestone met. Just having the Boulder Badge makes your Pokemon more powerful. It also enables you to use move Flash outside of battle. Of course, the Pokemon must know Move Flash to use it. Glorp got $140 million. Holy shit, $140 million. Wait, take this with you. Glorp received TM39 from Brock. Glorp put the TM in the TM case. Mish is a tech, yeah, 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 yeah. Using TM teaches your move, yeah, 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 yeah. A TM is only good for one use only. So when you use it, pick the Pokemon carefully. Anyways, it contains Rock Tomb, baby. Hope I get a, hope I get a Rock Pokemon, that'd be fun. That'd be real fun, I'd like a Rock Pokemon. Dude, we did it. We did it. I can't believe we won. We won. We destroyed that son of a gun. My boy, the Don. The Don came out swinging. Wasn't no stopping him. There's no, I can buy more potions now. Woo, potions, baby. I can buy more potions and Pokeballs and shit. Hi there. Yes, let me buy your shit. Awakening, burn heal, escape rope. Uh, burn heal's good to have. Because, you know, burn works the same as poison. Oh, shit, that costs a lot. Uh... I actually have to buy potions and shit? This is ridiculous. I actually have to play the game right? This is this is absolutely atrocious. I should have bought an antidote. No, there's no there's no poison Pokemons in the in the cave, is there? There better not be. There's probably someone with a Caterpie on the way there. It's gonna fuck me up. I I, I swore, I'm sorry. I'm sorry, I swore. This is this is this is who I am. This is who I am. You don't need to learn flash till when. When do you need to learn flash? I don't remember. Let's go battle someone online. Oh wait, there's no online fu functionality in this game. You need like link cables or some bullshit like that. Good old link. Remember, hey guys, do you remember link cables? I remember link cables. I, I remember. I remember link cables. Oh, I remember. I remember. It's gonna be really hard to juggle all these Pokemon. I'm not used to this. I'm only used to like grinding out one Pokemon and him just decimating everybody. You know how? You know the strongest Pokemon I ever gotten was like level 69. That's it. That's the farthest I go. I don't go to level 100. That's ridiculous. What's going on in here? Need arena, sit. Need arena, bow wow. He's a dog. Our Pokemon, our Pokemon's an outsider, so it's f it's thickin' and hard to handle. It's finicky. Oh, an outsider is a Pokemon that you get in a trade. It grows fast, but it may ignore an unskilled trainer in battle. If only we had some badges. I have a badge. I got a badge. I'm a good badge boy. I'm a good old badge boy. Who's a good old badge boy? Me? Me? I'm a good old badge. Why, why do I keep talking like a dog? Why do I keep talking? Use cut. Just get a hatchet. Why can't that be the... The Pokemon trainer should bring like a hatchet and like a flamethrower and just like random shit. So like you don't have to like teach your Pokemon like, ah, oh, yes, teach my Pokemon how to do the do the attack. Oh, Glorp. 
I'm glad I caught up to you. I'm Professor Oak's aide, remember? I've been asked to deliver this, so, so here to you. Running shoes from the aide. Glorp switched shoes with the running shoes. Press the B button to run. Did you know? Well, I must be going to back to the lab. Bye bye. Doop -doo -doop -doo -doo. Back to the lab. I wish I gave you those. There's a letter attached. Dear Glorp, here's a pair of running shoes from your be from my beloved challenger. Remember, I'll always cheer for you. Don't ever give up. From mom. Thanks, mom. Thanks, mom. I love you, mom. Thanks, man. Mom, she's always she's always looking out for me. She's she's always got my back. She's she she never she never abandoned me. For the for the fair. <laughs> She never abandoned me to go to the fair without me. This is bullshit, Mom. Why do you not love me?